Bob's Boneyard, where we're all about barkers, blood, books, boxes, and burps. This is going to be my first mukbang video. I've got a bunch of Starbucks stuff here. Uh, I have been getting a lot of requests to do something mukbang, so I decided to do something with Starbucks. So, something that I want to talk about. I have this Frappuccino right here. And I have this really cute pack of straws that I got from Starbucks. It has a straw cleaner and it also has a purple straw and a pretty straw. I'm gonna use the pretty straw. And I really love like reusable straws like this because I hate plastic disposable straws. Mmm. Um, plastic disposable straws are stupid. They end up in the ocean and they hurt our turtles and they're bad for the environment. And at Starbucks, there are cups with sippy lids and people still choose to get a straw for those. Like why? Just, it's not that hard. And then drinks like this, the barista started to hand me a straw and I was like, no, that's okay. I don't need a straw. Like, it's not that hard. Little baby steps to save the environment. Anyway. One of their most popular items at Starbucks is a double smoked bacon. It's got bacon, obviously. Egg and cheese. This is what it looks like. Got the bacon, the egg cheese um on a croissant bread which is awesome i love that probably my favorite part mm. i was so hungry i haven't eaten for hours purely for this video so i wanted to make sure that I had an appetite for this mukbang. I'm so hungry. Mm -hmm. mm. I was so hungry. I was like shaking. So this is really satisfying right now. Everyone goes to Starbucks for the drinks. But they've got really, really good food items too. And they've also got um, vegetarian options. Like they're Spinach feta wrap is super, super good too. They've got really good croissants, even the, the croissant on the sandwich. One of their pastries that's really good and really popular is their cheese danish. Um, it's got, I guess it's not really like, it's kind of like croissanty and uh, the cream cheesy stuff in the middle. It's really, really good and sweet. So this drink that I have right here, it's called a cookie cream frappuccino. <laughs> um, so it's like a mocha cookie crumble, but it's a cream based version. So there's no coffee in it because I had coffee this morning and I don't want to be up all night. But it's got mocha and whipped cream on the bottom and on the top, as well as java chips um, and cookie sprinkles. So yeah, it's really yummy. It's like, you know, a milkshake, like a chocolate milkshake. <laughs> I also want to show off this other Starbucks cup that I have that's really cool. It's like glisteny and um, another straw that I can use with other drinks. There's just water in here. What else do we got? Here's a cool one. So this one is a red velvet 
iced loaf. So it's one of the sweeter things and this is seasonal. It's like a Valentine's Day type of a thing. So it's not always there. It's got the icing on the top. It's kind of like having a cake. The icing is also the best part. It's not as good once you finish all of the icing. Like a cake without frosting, you know? Like that's just not as good. Um, so one thing that a lot of people have been asking me about is my burps. They're always like, why do you burp in your videos? Well, my answer is, why not? What's wrong with burps? Obviously you guys like it. Everyone comments on my burps in videos that aren't about burps. So I'm gonna just keep burping. I like it, it's fun, I'm good at it. It's a real talent, okay you guys? Starbucks also has cookies. You know, just regular chocolate chip chewy cookies. I love cookies. Okay, I was talking to you guys about the croissants earlier. Their butter croissants are so just fluffy and good. I love them. They're so like light and airy and just, it's like eating a cloud. Man, all these sweets, I'm starting to feel a little icky. But I still have more, so I have to keep going. All right. This is a petite vanilla bean scone. actually my first time having one of these. I've had all of these before. I didn't expect this to have a lemony taste to it. Interesting. Hmm. They've also got old-fashioned donuts. Very sweet and glazed-ish. As you guys know, I am an actor. I started getting into acting when I was in fifth grade. Uh, I was cast in this just like little after school theater program thingy and I was a bubble and it was really cute. And um, it was, you know, it was just like a small little thing, but it was um, enlightening to me and being on stage and Doing that, I was like, okay, I'm gonna keep doing this. So here I am all these years later, still doing it. Okay, I saved the best for last. Because everybody knows Starbucks has really, really good cake pops. And they don't really taste like cake. Like it's not, because cake, is dry and boring but this is like just a ball of sugar and it's so yummy spicy 
for last since it's this. And the birthday cake one. This one. These are better than the chocolate ones. Because they've got birthday cake, chocolate, and cookie dough. And this one's the best. When I was in that play in fifth grade, my mom was actually worried about me because I was so shy I wouldn't even talk in class. I wouldn't even raise my hand or answer questions because I didn't want anybody to hear my voice. So she didn't think I was gonna go through with it. She thought I wouldn't say my lines, but. So I think when I did, I kind of surprised everyone, my mom included and everyone in my class and my teachers. And for some people told me that it was the first time they'd ever heard my voice, including kids in my own class. So yeah, but I don't think I'm like that anyway. I've been burping even longer than I've been acting though. I just like grew up burping because my mom burps all the time and it was just a normal thing. So I was just like, oh, we burp. So I would just burp all the time. <laughs> there are times that I would get in trouble uh, and not in um, school, but like at, at recess, I would burp and people would get mad at me and I'd get in trouble. Just stupid. <laughs> Look at me now! <laughs> I don't remember since I was so little, but my mom tells me that when I was um, like super little, like a toddler, and I would burp really loudly in front of like her friends and grown men and they'd be like, like they'd be so shook to hear a tiny little girl burping that loudly. So I guess, since it's always been in my life and it's a lot of who I am as a person, I was like, well, there's no reason not to include it in my YouTube channel. Like if people don't like it or it's gonna gross them out or it's gonna turn them away, then I'm not the kind of person for them and that's okay. But it's also gonna make the people that are my kind of people, they're gonna like it just like I like it. Probably gonna take me like a few hours to finish this, honestly. I'm like really slow. But I got my pretty straw. Straws make great gifts, also, in my opinion. Some people would disagree with me, they think that's stupid. But you know what? The planet appreciates it. So when you guys go to Starbucks, and you buy a frappuccino, buy a straw with it so that every time you get a frappuccino, you no longer have to kill turtles in the process. And then for your other drinks, like your vanilla sweet cream cold brews or your Irish cream cold brews, just use the sippy lid. Just drink, just use your lips. It's not that hard. Don't kill turtles. Okay, I'm not gonna be able to finish all this food. I tried, so sorry. Maybe next time I need to go like a whole day without eating. That's not gonna happen. I can't go that long without eating. I like eating too much. But I guess my issue is that I eat small proportions, but constantly. So instead of like three meals a day that are big, it's more like 12 meals a day that are teeny. Does that make sense? So I just don't eat a lot at one time. I'm just always eating, you know? So I don't know, maybe I'll do better next time. Maybe I'll actually be able to eat an entire thing. But I tried, uh, a lot of you guys requested this. So I hope that I did okay. You can leave me a comment. Let me know how my first mukbang went, if you enjoyed it. Uh, you can let me know how you think about Starbucks, uh, what you like from them, what you order from there. And let me know if you guys have reusable straws as well and if you use them and if you save the turtles too.
as always, if you enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe, hit the notification bell, leave a comment, and I'll see you next time.